Good evening. Tonight I want to talk to you about incremental progress. You know all the sayings about starting small. The big things start small. The best time to plant a tree is 20 years ago. The second best time is now. So we know this concept, but why don't we usually take action? The problem is we're usually thinking about the big picture too much. I can't run a full marathon. It's way too complex to build that startup. There's no way I could lose all of that weight. The problem is that we think about the big picture. We try to say we need to do all of this when we actually really just need to start small. Throughout the past couple of years, I ended up starting and stopping running a few times, whether it was because I'm moving to a high altitude area or just because I thought the winter was way too cold. There's a program called Couch to 5K where they start with walking and running and they just alternate between the two, slowly building up your endurance. I've had to do that program three or four times already. Each time through the program, I would get a little bit further, a little bit faster. And after a while, I was able to run my 5K. Eventually, I started doing the couch to 10K, and I was able to build up that endurance from a 5K to the 10K. And now I'm able to consistently run a 10K. It is just a habit that I started small and slowly built up over the years. It isn't a big deal that I didn't do that in one summer, but it was okay that I took a year or two in order to build up that endurance. I was just trying to build a healthy habit. Each time I go out and run, I'm trying to get just a little bit better. Most of the time it's a wash, but the important part is just getting out there and running. Consistency is key. In the beginning of 2020, I really wanted to improve my pull-ups. I was struggling to do even three pull-ups. So when I started working from home, I saw it as an opportunity. I got a pull-up bar, set it up in the house, and every time I went to the bathroom or just got up from my desk, I tried to do some pull-ups. Just tried to get as many reps as I could in a given day. Eventually that three pull-ups became four, the four became five, and now I'm up to a max rep of eight. It's taken me a year, but that's okay. I'm not trying to rush this. I'm sure if I was doing some workout program, I might be able to progress that much faster. But the thing is, if I hadn't done anything, I'd still be struggling with three today. Now obviously this concept applies to more than just exercise. Reading 15 minutes before bed will help you get through more books in a year than if you don't read at all. Now the goal is to become very clear about what you're trying to achieve, to figure out the smallest incremental thing you can do to work towards that. Consistency is key. Time is going to pass with you or without you. Might as well try to take advantage of each day and get a little bit closer to those goals. Last week I was researching some open source solutions to help with managing my note system, which is in text-based file. And there's some really good solutions out there, but nothing quite did what I was looking for. And so I was thinking through, do I want to build this solution? My mind went, immediately went to, I want to be able to search for files, create new files based on templates, be able to save the history of my files, being able to um, quickly open up the editor um, with the folders that I want. So I had all these really good ideas, but the problem is that it would take me forever to build all of these things. I started to get overwhelmed with the idea of me having to build all of those features, and then I remembered I could just start small. And by building only a couple of small features within two nights, I was able to get most of the things that I really needed from this solution. And some of the other tools were able to help fill in some of the gaps that I was thinking about. Now it isn't a perfect solution, but it gets me closer there today than it was a week ago. Starting small is really important. And that's why I'm starting this video. I know this video is going to suck. I know I'm probably not delivering these lines very well. I know the lighting isn't great. There's all, all these things that could potentially change. But by starting small and trying to improve with each video, I'm sure that a year from now, I'll be much better than I am today. I would recommend be intentional with your habits. They really can compound. My running habit led to me being able to lose weight. It also reinforced this idea of being able to start small and it's okay just to make incremental progress every day. Pick a small habit that you can start tomorrow morning. And if you do, let me know in the comments. Have a good night and I'll see you next week.